Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. You are all warmly welcome uh, for this uh, uh, ACEF uh, Beijing and uh, STPI MOU signing ceremony. So both the organizations, they are uh, for establishing a knowledge partnership, uh, conduct research jointly, policy analysis, capacity building and outreach, and then ACF CPI are desirous of entering into collaboration with expression of their interest in cooperation with each other to launch new research and regional integration in initiatives. Now, in the in the MOU, there are 10 areas and the details are there. Uh, but um, in view of the very short time, this is the essence of the MOU. Uh, what what we are desired by way of the objectives of the um, of the military of understanding. We have discussion and uh, uh, both sides have given uh, their uh, broad priority thematic areas and issue of priority interest. Now, on the CEF side, uh, the priority area of research and joint work are the enterprise and industry matchmaking, interaction experience sharing on green technology. STPI preferred thematic areas, uh, which I shared with uh, with ACF in consultation with my colleagues, and uh, uh, we have the uh, the CPEC issues uh, and uh, with that regard, special economic zones, sustainable industrial development. Now, the sustainable industrial development cannot be without green technology. So already there is a synergy between the between the between the research areas. I mean, you are interested you are interested in green technology transfer, and we would be needing that for the sustainable industrial development in Pakistan. So here is already a synergetic area of research work and joint work between the ACEF and, uh, SDP, uh, and SDPI. Then also, uh, SDPI is interested in social cultural impacts of CPEC, infrastructure, energy projects, environment impact assessment, food security, agriculture, and economics. And again, uh, these are just few priorities area, but we are not limited to it. Changing the habitual to like the accolades, it's a great pleasure to see ACEF and SDPI move together and sign MOU today with the efforts of the colleagues from two sets. This is a good start and a significant step towards a further practical and specific cooperation. Especially, this is quite meaningful in this of the global challenge from the pandemic, pandemic COVID-19. Uh, concerning Green Belt and Road, as a member of Silk and Road NGO Cooperation Network, International Coalition for Green Development on the Belt and Road, SAEF would continue to work as a bridge between the government, public, and the private sectors and the civil societies, promoting environmental policy improvement, coverage social responsibility for green and sustainable BRI project development. At the meantime, SAEF would like to work with partners to participate in the coming CBD COP, uh, 15 Belt and Road Forum for International Cooperation to be hosted in China. Thank you uh, very much, uh, uh, Honorable uh, Xi Zhu Hong, uh, uh, respected uh, Ling Ling, and uh, all the colleagues from uh, uh, All China Environment Federation. Uh, it's uh, a great player uh, that uh, both the organizations uh, they are uh, entering in a partnership, and a special credit goes to. Uh, my colleague, uh, Dr. Mahmoud Khwaja, uh, for his uh, untiring efforts uh, for uh, the last uh, one year, uh, whereby he was trying to bring uh, both the organization uh, close and uh, also uh, look at some areas of uh, mutual interest and uh, joint harmony. Uh, I must say that uh, uh, CPEC uh, to uh, Pakistan uh, is what BRI to China is, and uh, we very uh, proudly say that uh, CPEC is a jewel uh, in Belt and Road Initiative of China. So success of CPEC uh, actually uh, translates into success of Belt and Road Initiative. And uh, that's why uh, both the government of China and government of Pakistan, they're trying to do their best uh, to unfold uh, this uh, project uh, in uh, mutually synergetic uh, manner. Now, uh, what we have uh, realized over the years that while there is excellent uh, government to government relations, there are excellent business to business relations, and there are excellent 
academia to academic uh, uh, relations between Pakistan and China, the relation between civil society organizations on both sides, uh, those uh, need to be uh, improved a lot. Uh, and uh, that is, I think, uh, a step forward uh, when ACEF and SGPI today, when we will be formally signing uh, the MOU, when we will be formally uh, agreeing to work together. Uh, let, let me also uh, take this opportunity to register our interest and um, appreciation for the, 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 the three very important initiatives which uh, uh, ACEF has been leading, including the raising of awareness around environment rights protection, food waste, and phasing out of dental amalgam. Uh, we certainly uh, appreciate these initiatives and we are glad that we are part of these at some level uh, through Dr. Mahmoud Khwaja, of course. Um, we also share uh, interests with regard to the strategic partners with whom we work. And uh, I believe it will be an excellent opportunity to approach them for joint uh, projects in future, as Dr. Suleri was also talking about. So I see that ACEF has strategic partners, which includes uh, JUNEP, UNDP, and IUCN, all three of whom share very uh, warm working relationship with SDPI as well. And I think uh, by way of ending, I would once again reiterate uh, uh, the request and the proposal around exchange visits between the faculties, uh, maybe exchange of speakers uh, at the time of uh, the annual sustainable development conference in Islamabad, and of course, taking this work uh, forward. Uh, it is again a very proud moment for STPI to be partnering with you. Uh, thank you for thinking uh, of us and thank you for con considering us for this partnership. So it's time for signing the MOU now. Uh, I, I request uh, Madam, Madam Z, Dr. Abid, uh, and yourself to, uh, to, to please sign the MOU.